here. Practical jokes with the lasers. And I just need to get it there. Which would be a lot easier if I had like... But I, I can actually feed... Now, it, now can, I can feed the la that, that laser. Okay. This, this solves the situation. So we can engage this. Now we have a laser that goes to the portal here. There. Okay, so it it port it removed the portal, but I'm I'm still with the, with this beam. Okay, so I was half wrong and half correct. Nice. Crazy crazy science. Also, I don't see myself, and the game screen is a bit... Ah. No, well, now no we are here. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I suppose I can't use that footage if it's all <laughs> corrupted. Surprise! What's that look on your face? Did you expect something bad? Lasers. Yes. It's an actual elevator straight to the surface. Rare find. You're welcome, by the way. I know you humans love the sky for some reason, so I thought this would excite you. Right. Look, I know what you're thinking. You really don't trust me. And I've done nothing but sounding like a raving lunatic or a sociopath. Probably both at once, if I'm gonna be honest. In the interest of transparency, this elevator will take you up to the surface. Uh, only thing is, it's not all the way out of the enrichment center. When we get to the surface, we still have a little way to go before we can complete your half of the deal. I'll try to help you where I can with these old test chambers, but... Uh, there's been a lot of decay, if you catch my drift. But hey, look at the bright side. There's fresh air, it's sunny outside, and I think there's a cool breeze. Just uh -huh. watch out for wild animals. Those are brutal. With any luck, this should take just a few minutes, and then you can go free. Hope we're in the clear now. Portal with the uh, wild animals would be fun. Yay. Go take a look out that window for a moment. See that huge spire in the distance? That's where we're headed. Little confession. I don't know for sure whether it still works. It is possible that there is just a pile of rubble waiting for us. Judging by how torn apart this place is, I'd give that chance a possibility of... Ooh, you know what? Never mind. I hate to say it, but we need to find a testing track. Look, I'm sorry. I don't want to torture you with endless testing. You already proved that you're capable. Problem is that these backstage areas aren't built to be as durable as the test chambers. To cover any ground here, we need to move between testing tracks. Right. Good find, but this testing track isn't in good shape. Hmm, there should be another one not far from here. See if you can find it. Again, good 
good attempt, but this test is broken. You need to find another one. Okay, now it came through. <laughs> Find another one, okay. Okay, uh, can't get out. But... How do we proceed? Well, the portal is at least working. So, uh, okay, I got here. <laughs> now what? Slightly weird. Find another test track. I wonder how. So this was a uh, dead end with the with the portal. Okay. Dead end, dead end with the location for portal. <laughs> that, that 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 solves it. Pretty basic, really. I suppose that's where we should go. Do I die if I jump from here? Hmm. Pizzas. And this elevator doesn't have any buttons. Yeah, sure. That would have been too easy. How about water? Landing on water isn't as uh, soft as it used to be. So. Now I just need to get down. Unless I take a running jump. Whee! Okay. Apparently, my bones are made from titanium or something. Well, this is fresh.
That's much better. Might be a bit overgrown, but the hardware still works. They really use fine materials for these tests. Have to protect your investments, after all. Unbreakable materials are expensive. Yeah. <laughs> I guess. I guess. Unbreakable materials, okay. here no okay okay some something opened Okay, now, now I need to get back up there. Basically. And we have a platform here that's angled. Oh no, it's going to be a jumping puzzle. Okay. Here we go! Ouch. Did you know that this iteration of your Aperture Science handheld portal device has been specifically configured to not shoot portals further than 8 kilometers? I wonder why. Uh, they quickly learn to limit the range on these things. You can easily end the whole world if you put a portal on the sign. Ouch. But we did shoot, shoot it to the moon in the end of Portal 2. is in such a rough state. I don't want to say it before, but this place is such a mess. This will take so long to clean up. Whoever did this was very thorough in their work. Okay, not heavy enough. Up. Oh no. Yeah. Okay, let's Okay. That can work. But I still need something to push the button down. That's that's kind of problem here. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Okay. A lot of load of nothing. Although we can we can get that there. Have to add some time. Okay, so 
So you can shoot the portal to the, through the grills, okay. Nice. Can you... Okay, so I need to get here. Okay, now it's, now it's there. Okay. So this is this is one of those crazy f flying. Ouch. Let's make it a bit, bit farther. Several uses on same portal. Yep. Okay. Here's this thing. Cube. Here and plan our uh, crazy flight. Okay, S that should this should work. Yeah, it it worked. Okay, now we <laughs> we are. Oh, I just realized you don't even know how this all happened. Yep. Uh, long ago was run by a central core capable of monitoring and maintaining the whole facility. Certain tasks were outsourced to other cores, like me. Everything was great, you know? Uh -huh. Utopia. Until one human test subject, this little monster, just had to ruin our lives and killed her. And that's that. Most of my colleagues either went crazy, died, or disappeared. What else were we supposed to do if we can't fulfill our purpose? So we have a... So that's a, that, that's an exit. And those seem to be hanging around quite dangerous looking. Anything I could drop? Ah! Okay, <laughs> I dropped. Yeah, this is an angled shot just like I need to just shoot my way through. So, where I can drop? That seems totally safe. So this is uh, time after Gladys. Yeah. So how crazy are we? Uh, pretty crazy. So I should like go here, shoot my way down, or I have to make a portal down here, and when I'm 
midair, use portal here, and fly over there. There. Okay. Whee! Okay, that works. I promise you could leave once we're done. But if you ever need a job in the future, don't hesitate to come back. Okay. I'd rather say this before it's too late. Use the gels sparingly. The tanks aren't being refilled anymore, and what's left won't last forever. Once they're empty, we're gonna have a little problem. The gels are also highly corrosive and will eat through metal and skin given enough time. Might be good to know. Doesn't sound sound really safe. Okay, where's the other end of the portal? This kind of place. So is this... Uh, hey, I can see the sky. So basically it's beneath us. Ah, over there. So, uh, we can jump and get some speed. Could fly over there. See what happens. Fly over here. And let's see let's see what what happens in this crazy test? Ah, oh, it's it's a bouncing, bouncing stuff. Yes, now we have a companion cube. Companion cube understands everything. Best friend human can have. Companion cube. Not too hard, but you need to work for it. Okay, this is too much. Watching me fly through the air like that looks pretty fun. Sometimes I wish I could do the same. were never designed to be exposed to the surface. Uh -huh. I've not come across any toxic plants yet, but stay alert. There's a reason we don't do experiments in the open anymore. Okay, there's a turret. Oh no. That's uh, some kind of repulsor feel, feel, uh, right? I 
and that's where we <laughs> we are supposed to go. So definitely we need some. We need that stuff. Ah, there's a rain. Basically, a water curtain here, and that—that's kind of that's what what ends the beam from actually. Okay, that that turns it turns it off. Now the goo is coming. Okay, I think this just became a more hazardous. That works. Mythbusters. Okay, let's repeat that. Rain check. Well, that helps. So I weaponized the bouncy, bouncy fluid. Okay, flowers, nice. Congratulations on completing this test. We hope you enjoyed your experience at the Aperture Science Center for who writes these protocols? Is this all just randomly generated? Probably. Oh, of course you enjoyed it. We designed the test that way. <sighs> There's a reason I don't use those scripts. I could barely get through them when I first tested you. Yeah. <laughs> Remember that? What did you think of my announcing voice, by the way? I've been practicing it. So what is this fluid? Ah, uh, I can push something something down here and it lifts the elevator. But I, first I need the something to push it down and I probably need something to make this uh a little little le less traction would be nice. And what is this? What? Do we have a two-way gun now? No. 
Okei, okay, tässä on Speedy. Speedy Gonzales. Okei, okay, so this is kind of goating the cube. With the stuff. But it immediately washed away. Doesn't slide. I'm placing it here. Yep, it would be too too late. Okay, that works. Well, this works. Might might have been a new addition for this mod. Wouldn't it be great to take a break from all the testing just to have a nice, long, warm shower under the cleansing fields, washing your hair, watching your skin peel off? Yes, no. me right. Don't try that. The fluid cleanses more than gels. <laughs> 